We're taking a live look at the construction site of La Nube. That's the El Paso Children's Museum in downtown El Paso. Everything looking clear right now, but the fire department quickly responding to a fire there earlier today. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Natasia Paloma. The fire causing road closures in that area as crews assess the damage. Our KTSM 9 News reporter Carla Draxer is there. Carla, how are things looking right now? Natasia, I can tell you that the fire units are actually packing up at the moment. Uh, they're about to leave the scene. We're seeing them uh, picking up some of their things, and the fire has been knocked down since earlier this afternoon, but I can tell you uh, it was a pretty active scene earlier. There were 21 fire units out here. That's what the fire chief told us, and the firefighters really did respond quickly. It took them only three minutes to get here after they got that call at 2.15 about the fire. And now, like I said, the fire has been been since extinguished since about 2 30 this afternoon but the call came in uh, just after uh, 2 p.m. Uh, of they got the call of a heavy smoke caused by an explosion inside that then turned into a fire that's according to the fire chief he says all the workers got out on time and there are no injuries reported a couple of surrounding streets are closed down as the fire crews uh, keep working uh, but uh, no other areas had to be evacuated now, the El Paso Children's Museum was supposed to open sometime this fall, but this will now have to be delayed. Um, once we know the extent of damages, we'll find out what work has to be redone, what materials have to be reordered um, to be reinstalled. Um, we had hoped for a fall of 2023 opening. Um, maybe it's a winter 2024 now. I'm sure probably a couple months. It was between the two, the two loops you see behind us, right in the middle there, where the that's probably where the construction material is stacked, and that's where the fire was in the construction material itself. And as you've heard, they're still assessing, trying to find out what exactly caused this explosion that turned into a fire and what the exact damage is inside the building. But you heard it, the opening day of the El Paso uh, Children's Museum will definitely have to be delayed. At the time, like I said, the firefighters are actually packing up. The street is still uh, blocked off at the moment, but I'm assuming soon enough these fire trucks will be uh, leaving and the streets should be cleared uh, sometime soon, but we'll make sure to keep you updated on that later on in the later newscasts. Back to you, Natasia.